Hey everyone, it's Christopher Vincent, and this week we'll be discussing bullying and how it has affected us in any ways at all. So, first off, I started to get bullied in 5th grade when I changed schools. I was the new kid at school that no one really knew. I didn't know too many people I knew. I, I, I had met a couple people within the first week of going to my new school. Well, one of the people that I met, she told me that there were a whole bunch of people that were calling me gay, and I didn't understand why. I'm just a little fifth grader who pretty much looks and dresses like everyone else, and someone's telling me that these people are calling me gay, and I don't understand why. So I talked to her about it and asked her who's calling me gay and why they're calling me gay, and she... I don't really remember exactly what she said. All I remember is after she told me that, I started to realize and notice and see all the people that were teasing me and starting rumors about me. I mean, I didn't even think about sexual orientation or liking anyone in fifth grade for that matter. I pretty much, for the most part, looked like everyone else. Towards about the middle of fifth grade, I pretty much noticed that everyone in the entire school knew me as that one gay kid when I didn't even think of myself as being gay because I didn't even really honestly like anyone. So I think that's where really where a lot of my lack of confidence came from was from fifth grade and everyone bullying me. And you know it didn't stop there because when I went to seventh and eighth grade when I went to junior high they all went there and then the group that hated me that group got bigger because they made new friends and then even more people knew about me and it just seemed to escalate in seventh grade. And you know 8th grade was really the year when I woke up and said, fuck it, why the fuck do I want to try to worry about and conform to what everyone else is going to do and worry about what everyone else is saying about me? So 8th grade was really the year that I started to just ignore everything around me that was negative in any way, shape, or form. And I only focused on the positives and I only focused on hanging out with my friends and coming home to my family that loves me. If it weren't for me waking up that one day in 8th grade, then I would have no self-confidence and I wouldn't be the person that I am today. Now obviously there were a lot of people who teased me in high school and still said shit about me, but I paid absolutely no attention to them. And I pretty much just told myself, go to school, be the person that you're going to be, don't ever try to change yourself because other people don't like the way that you act. You know, the best advice that I could give to anyone if they're being bullied is if someone's threatening to hurt you, then you need to go to an adult or someone who can help you. And really guys, it's just not worth getting into a fight because of something so petty as someone who you don't even really know doesn't like the way that you dress or act. If someone says something about you and you feel the need to defend yourself, do it, but don't go looking for fights because someone doesn't like you. Eventually at some point in their life, karma's gonna come around and bite them in the ass, and it's gonna be hard and painful. So you know, it's just really important that you stay strong, believe in yourself, talk to people if you're having issues, and to just ignore anything that people say, because really, five years from now, they're gonna forget all about you. And while that pain inside of you still remains to that day, what you need to realize is that they're the ones who have the issue and that there's nothing wrong with you. So if anyone has any stories or anything to share about bullying, please feel free and make a video response and let everyone know your story. Thank you, have a good day.